Well, everyone, the votes have been counted. And it was a close one again, surprisingly. Um, by one vote, this nation won. And it was... Dun, 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 dun. Dun, 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 dun. Yes, it was the United Provinces by one vote, everyone. And uh, I've never done a United Provinces campaign. I should have said, really, that I had done a... Um, Sweden campaign before but I forgot because I did it such a long time ago but this should be interesting because I have uh, never done one of these before so it's going to be a long campaign we're not going to do world domination because well, that's just silly that's just silly plus this one can go on for a hundred years which is fine um, but anyway I'm going to do it on hard hard and uh, let's get started Oh yes, loading screens. I'm going to have to get used to this empire and its loading screens. I have a very suitable beverage today. I have some tea. Of course, this is the time when Britain and other countries were importing all their lovely, lovely f teas and stuff. What is that? Come on, game. I'm playing. Should be to defend your home region against the Catholic Spanish, who are seeking to destroy Protestantism and restore superstition. Oh, that's too far too long to watch. Right, so let's see who we're at war with at first. Mm, just the Barbary states, so the pirates. Right, uh, who's hostile with me? So France is hostile with me. Spain is hostile with me. These are, so we don't really have any friends. That's probably something to do with the fact that we're um, Protestants. I could do with getting an um, in a, a, a allegiance allegiance with um what's his name? All right, well, let's check the government as well. So they're not very happy. They're not very happy. They're very happy. Right, let's see if we've got any better people. He's better than... We could do with having a good head of state. Head of cabinet, even. But we need... We're... I know we're not an island nation, but our navy has to be very strong because we are have such a small landing in, um, in Europe. So we're going to upgrade all our stuff in here. And in a minute we'll get some trade agreements. What's the difference between these two militia? Oh, I've just realised something. I'll be right back. <laughs> Alright, everyone. Um, I just had to turn down the size of the uh, units because um, while my computer's good, it's not that good. <laughs> it won't be able to take, especially towards the end of the game when you've got, you know, over like 3,000 sometimes men on each side. Um, and if you've got, say, these guys have got 400 men in a unit and these line infantry have got about 300, it's just a bit too much. So I've just lowered them down one notch, so it shouldn't be too uh, too much of a problem. So in terms of research, we're going to first concentrate on... Uh, the, I always go plug bayonet first. Always go plug bayonet first. And then we'll be going on the naval li uh, line for a while. Maybe one or two. So we can start building up our naval defences but of course we need to bolster our land defences first and just gonna look at the difference 35, 40 so they're not that much worse how much do they cost to upkeep? 200 compared to 230, it's not really that <laughs> get a couple of units of these, have we got any cavalry, um, artillery? we got one unit of artillery I'll keep the pikemen until they get killed off keep the artillery in that in that army, uh, tell you what, we'll get rid of that and get one unit of cavalry. Right, we're making about sixteen hundred a turn. Uh, if we put the taxes up, one, will they be angry? Yes, lower classes. Haha, <laughs> filthy peasants can take. Actually, let's check over here. Do, oh, I uh, didn't think they'd like that. There we go. We'll do that for like one or one or two turns. Right, we'll just go and check over here. Dutch Guyana, I think this is. Yes. 
Alright, so let's upgrade these. Get some lovely money. Where's the money? Upgrade everything. France, this will probably be our first target in uh, America. Once we have a decent naval base, uh, as long as they don't attack us first, because I'd rather be uh, get prepared. And we'll build uh, magistrates there. And some... Oh, some weird noise, some roads. <sighs> right. Ah, oh, we also have a little thingy here. I didn't know that. We did not do that. Right, so we're going to get colonial line infantry. They're both the same. It's, I don't know what's got. Oh, they're different, though. I think one of these is... Oh, I don't know. Maybe it's just a little glitch. Never mind. Do they cost less? They cost 900, I think. And the colonial infantry are actually better. They've actually got different stats. Right, so we'll go with these guys then. They're cheaper and better. Uh, roads come. Oh no! Look how much money we look how much money we've got. We can afford the roads. Right, we've got a little fleet here. What is this pirate fleet like? Oh, we'll have that. Let's get a little battle going to start off the game with. I won't be doing as many quick saves in Empire as I was in Napoleon. Um, that's because it kind of kills it. You know what I mean? If you lose anything, you can just go, oh, it doesn't matter, I'll just go back and do it, and it sort of stifles the campaign a bit, so I probably won't be doing that very often, which is a good thing in my mind. I have no idea how long this video's been on, so we'll just start the hour from now. Or maybe I'll end up doing longer. I just don't know. I love Empire. That's bit, I love Darth Mod. Let me rephrase that. Look at the flags. Beautiful. Right. Ah... Oh. I love navies, especially from these days. Alright, let's get up here, bring everything forwards. Now, I'm not the best naval tactician you'll ever see. I'm I'm, I'm pretty good, I feel. Uh, la, la, la. We'll put the 6th rate first, because they've only got brigs as far as I saw. And we'll keep the sloop with the main... F uh, no, we'll keep the brig with the main force and send the sloop. I'm assuming they'll spawn here-ish, I don't know. So, group them. Off you go. Speed it up. We'll leave the sloop for a while because they go super duper fast. So it can catch up later. Yeah, they're, they're, the AI is doing what it always does. <laughs> Turn in towards you. And this allows me to sneak up behind. Is that sloop called Fancy? Flying Dutchman. Oh, do you know what I need to do? I need to rename all these ships, don't I? <laughs> oh my god. I'm such a nerd. Go! What's this ship called? Pera. Go, Pera. Pool War. Uh oh. Okay, they're going to get the first shot in anyway, so we're going to go in between the two. Incoming! I need to turn it up for me. It's very quiet. I like it noisy. Oh, that sounded wrong. Yep, looks like we're just going to cut him behind. I'm going to break off the sloop now. Let him go in his own jolly way, because he can outpace these two. Actually, you know what? I'm just going to get rid of the entire group. It's just good for when they're sailing in uh, to getting somewhere. Right, you can take on this sloop. It looks like you're... Oh, no, I always spoke way too soon. Incoming! We lost one gun, sir. Actually, I, I, w I can't do a Dutch accent. It's probably the only accent I can't do. Right. We'll put chain shot on. Here we go. Yeah. I don't know how much damage this does because I don't have the flags on. Never mind. Turn away. You. Go. Where's the sloop gone? Come in. Uh oh. Oh, good job he's inaccurate. He hit all the water. Turn around. Otherwise you're going to get shot from the back. Faster. Who's winning this? How many... Yeah, he's taken some casualties. Incoming! Watch out. Ooh. No! What are you doing, man? 
go in between them. Fire! Or have we already fired? I think he's already fired. Where are you going? Seriously. Oh no. No, don't. It's oh, too close to my own ship for my own comfort. That's it. That's it. There he's wavering. No, you're hitting your own ship, you fool. Alright. Board. Come down. I want to capture as many of these as we can so we can sell them. You come around there, you're going to be there for ages. Let's see it. Keep firing into the stern. What are you doing? You're going to be boarding this thing. Look at. I just love the smoke that this mod adds in, you know. I tell you what, screw it. You, you're taking far too long. We'll just let the sloop board the sloop. Little, little duking out battle here. Yeah, it's pretty sure there's only going to be one winner. Oh, just missed. This sixth rank needs to get involved again. It's our second largest slip, ship, slip, slip, ship in this battle, and it's uh, floating around. Don't attack that. Uh, that's it. Um, oh no. Oh no. Oh no, he's getting absolutely, well he's not getting that badly hammered, that was a good shot. Right, come in, yes, this way. I'll turn the broadside on so it can't fire it on its own. Because I don't know what the AI is like, I can't really remember if even if there's a ship in the way it might still fire at it. Come on, go faster. You see, they've got the wind now and this sloop's left exposed. Or still, still in Guerf. Orangey. I'm assuming that means orange. It's fitting, I suppose, for the Dutch. Everything's orange, and still is orange. They really like orange. Is that because they sold oranges? I have no idea. Let's see how this boarding action's going. Nothing's happening. They're just firing at each other. You actually do. Oh, it's surrendered, that's why. Thanks for telling me, man. How many men has it got? Oh, d uh oh, he's gonna get in the way. Go that way. Watch out! Oh, oh well, they crashed. Oh no! I broke the thing off the end. What's that called? Oh damn it! Oh no! That was my admiral ship as well. Right. How many men has he got? Sixty-nine. Yes, we can take you. We can have you any day. My god, what is going on? Turn! Silly ship. Get out of my way! Oh. Incoming! Why are you turning around? AI, silly. Silly, bad AI. Blah, blah, blah. Am I missing another ship? Yeah, he's all the way down here. What the earth is going on? I'm losing control! Oh, damn it. You need to turn that way so he can go. Go! Why are you so slow? Fly! He's never going to catch that brig, is he? Sod it. You turn that way. There's no way of cancelling this either, which is a pain. Just turn so you can fire on him. You can actually hit it, please. There we go. See if you can board that one instead. Lovely. You. Come and cut him off. Whoa, did you see that broadside? It's a bit far away, but it's still epic. Just like the flash effects are. Oh, my tea's gone cold. Uh, uh. Oh, uh, that's disgusting. Oh, oh, get it away from me. Uh, uh, oh. 
That was sickening. Truly sickening. I don't think there's anything right. We can speed up a little bit now. Or can we go a bit further? Da, 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 da. Fire, fire. What are you doing? I told you to board it and you've fucked it up. Alright, we should have put canister shot on. Go. Fly like the wind, boy. Why can't you? Oh, it's because he's boarding it, apparently, but it's taking ages. These have two chaser guns. Do they have chaser guns? No, no chaser guns. But these have got uh, stern guns, you see. Oh dear. Why are you going so slow too? I'll tell you what, fire your broadside now so you can reload. Oh no! No, my mast! Was he using chain shot? Was he using chain shot? Come! Is it slowed down again? Yes, because the boarding action failed. Yeah, that's going to kill some of their crew. Can you imagine? Chain shot? It's like a million muskets all firing at once. Obviously not literally a million, but... It's nasty. Uh-oh. He sailed into the wrong ship. Oh, we didn't capture it though. Ah! Ah! Fire! Oh. As anticlimactic as expected, like a massive broadside, just make the ship like, roll over and sink. I oh, know it's a bit. It doesn't happen in this game. The ships bounce around a bit in uh, Napoleon, but in this one they don't really. At least I don't think they do. Yes, one thousand prize money. We could. Uh, which was there anything bigger than a brig? I don't think there was. Okay, uh, we'll just take the money then. Our first victory. Is there a port here? Lovely. We'll repair these. What can we recruit from here? A fleet? A flute? How do you say that? Is it like flute? Like the... Like the... um Instrument? Uh, trading ports. I'll try and remember them as well. Right, we'll build... That's got 42 guns. Uh, hulls. They cost more, but they're not as good. Oh, they they got slightly more firepower, but... Uh, no. We'll build one more of them and that will have us a nice little fleet there. Let's see if we can get some... Uh, we can get a trade agreement with Hanover. Please? Please! Why? We're very friendly. I can't give you anything. I don't want to become your ally because you'll get attacked by France straight away. I know it. We'll offer you 100 gold. Yay! I think that was actually a thousand. Damn it. Conned me. Westphalia. Will you take? Whatever. I've got loads of money. Hopefully it'll pay itself off over time. Is there a way of seeing independent trade routes? There is, I think. So, to Westphalia, we're making 400 a turn, people. So it's only going to take like three turns and we would have got all our money back. So, what's What arm have we got here? Just some militia. Militia! Oh, but we're militia, sir. Militia. Yeah, we don't do very much because we're, we're militia. Being a militia must be the worst job ever. So we'll probably get some line infantry from here, drag them down here, and then when the time comes, attack France. Uh, India. Oh my god, we haven't even finished the turn yet. Right, oh, this is quite a big town, actually. So we'll upgrade the barracks uh, and the magistracy. We'll get that and that so we improve happiness, we can afford it. Infrastructure, yes, please. We've got a Protestant man here. What's? Uh, we'll leave him here until. Uh oh, the money's running out. So we've got a cotton plantation. Uh, another fairly f small fleet. We don't have anything here, do we? No. Okay. All right. Uh, do -do -do -do. Like I said, fifth rate, just to bolster the ranks a bit. We don't have an admiral here, do we? So we might have to get him with the fifth rate. Protestant man. Okay, we don't really need a standing army here, so that's fine. Because we're not actually at war with anyone apart from the pirates yet. This turn will probably change all that, and then all of a sudden we'll be at war with everyone. Let's get you in the college for this turn. What's the navy like? Yeah, it's pretty average. So once again, another fifth rate. And we'll get him just patrolling around here. 
because France, you know, is um, yeah, they're a strong nation. Let's end the turn. Let's end the first turn. Whew. Oh dear, I'm glad I'm playing a different nation.